Hi, so in this video we are going to learn how to convert degrees to grades. So what is the basic thing in, in these kind of conversions? All these units of measuring angles are basically defined based on the number of right angles. So if somehow we can convert the given degrees or grades or radians into the number of right angles, from there we can directly convert it into any of the given units. Right? So the first thing we are going to learn over here is converting from degrees to grades. So the procedure for converting any angle from degrees to grades is first you have to convert seconds into minutes. This will give you minutes in decimal. Then you convert minutes into degrees. This will give you degrees in decimal. Then you divide it by 90 because 90 degrees is equal to one right angle. This we are doing to convert degrees into number of right angles. And then if we multiply this by 100, we will basically convert the degrees into grades because one right angle is equal to 100 grades. So we have one relation. One relation is one right angle is 90 degrees, which is also equal to 100 grades and which is also equal to pi by 2 radians. So if we remember this relation, we can convert angles from any unit to any other given unit, right? So we have these three problems in which we have to convert 30 degrees to grades, 81 degrees to grades and then we have slightly difficult problem where we have to convert 63 degrees, 14 minutes and 51 seconds to grades. So first we will convert 30 degrees to grades and we know one right angle is 90 degrees. That means 90 degrees is one right angle. That means 30 degrees will be 30 by 90 right angles. Zeros will cancel each other. 3 ones are 3, 3 threes are 9. That means it is actually equal to 1 by 3 right angles. And we know that one right angle is equal to 100 grades. That means this will be equal to 1 by 3 multiplied by 100 grades. And this is 3 ones are 3. 3 3 is a 9, 3 3 is a 9 point 3 and a bar over that number of grades, right? So this is the conversion of degrees to grades where we don't have any minutes or seconds. So we need not to bother about them. And now let's go to the second problem. In second problem, we have to convert 81 degrees to grades. 81 degrees will actually be equal to 81 divided by 90 right angles. 9 ones are 9, 0, 9 nines are 81. That means it is actually equal to 0 0.9 right angles. Each right angle is equal to 100 grades. That means 0 0.9 right angles will actually be equal to 0 0.9 multiplied by 100 grades. And this will be equal to 90 grades. So 81 degrees is actually equal to 90 grades. This was also very simple and now we are going to take 63 degrees 14 minutes and 51 seconds. This is going to be slightly tricky. We have to convert 63 degrees 14 minutes and 51 seconds to grades. So here we are going to follow this procedure. First we are going to convert 51 seconds into minutes. So 51 seconds will be equal to 51 divided by 60 minutes. This will be equal to, we have to use calculator over here, 51 divided by 60. This is equal to 0 0.85 minutes. So now we have total 14.85 minutes. So 14.85 minutes now needs to be converted into degrees. So 14.85 minutes will be actually equal to 14.85 divided by 60 degrees because each degree has 60 minutes. So this will be equal to 14.85 divided by 60 is equal to 0 0.2475 degrees, 
right so how many degrees do we have now here we had 63 degrees and these are the degrees in decimals which we have got by converting 14 minutes and 51 seconds into degrees right so the total number of degrees over here are 63.2475 this is the angle in degrees which was written like this and this will actually be equal to 63.2475 divided by 90 number of right angles and we know each right angle is equal to 100 grade so this will be equal to 63.2475 divided by 90 multiplied by 100 number of grades and this will be equal to 70.275 grades so this is in grades and grades actually follows decimal system properly so this will be actually equal to 70 grades and 27.5 minutes or this can be written as 70 grades 27 minutes and 50 seconds because in each grade we have 100 minutes and in each minute we have 100 seconds so this system perfectly follows the decimal system from here also we can directly write that it will be equal to 70 grades the numbers before the decimal after that two digits will be number of minutes and after that two digits will be number of seconds and after this we are going to learn how to convert grades into the degrees so keep watching math smart and bye bye till then